Hello friends, this is Denario Research and today I'll explain what is the hell cloud mining and how to make money on it. Well, cryptocurrency mining is quite popular business along with trading. Both have their pros and cons. Some people prefer trading, some mining, but I use both. So what is the goal of mining? Mining helps to protect blockchain network from attacks. Actually it acts like a shield. And as motivation, miners receive some coins as a reward. Today the most popular mining concept is proof of work. It is implemented in Bitcoin, Ethereum, Zcash and many other coins. Another popular concept is proof of stake. Peercoin, Novacoin and some other coins use it. Some coins actually have a mix of both, proof of work and proof of stake. And, but in this video I will talk exclusively about proof of work. If you want to know more about POW or POS or other concepts, click links below this video. Probably you heard stories how people made tons of money on Bitcoin mining, but these times are in the past. Today Bitcoin money is not such profitable as it was few years ago, due to following reasons. Halving. Bitcoin economy is built on decreasing miners' reward by half every four years. Last time this happened in July 2016. And now miners receive 12.5 bitcoins per block instead of 25 they earned before halving. Increasing block difficulty. Let's look at simplified case. Under the Bitcoin algorithm, block is being generated every 10 minutes. And let's assume that we have only 10 miners in the world. They work in pool and their combined hash power is extra hash per second. Every 10 minutes some of them find new block and profit is shared among 10 miners. If new miner with wider hash per second joins the group, they will have extra hash power x plus wider hash per second. And obviously they will generate new block faster than 10 minutes. Bitcoin algorithm detects that and makes mining process harder to maintain 10 minutes interval. And consequently the same profit that was shared among 10 miners will be shared among 11 miners. Look at Bitcoin block difficulty chart. As Bitcoin became popular more and more people started to mine and block difficulty made exponential growth and total profit declined. But block difficulty problem is not only about Bitcoin. Most of mineable currencies have it. The more people start to mine, the less profitable mining becomes. If you decide to start mining at home, you need hardware. In case of Bitcoin, you need specialized ASICs that cost quite a lot, more than 1000 bucks, and consume tons of electricity. And once your profit drops below electricity paycheck, your hardware becomes immediately useless, because you can't use it for mining other coins. That is why I don't recommend to start mining Bitcoin in 2017. Instead, I recommend you to buy video cards and mine other coins. Video cards consume much less electricity than ASICs and are suitable for mining several coins. For example, if you mine Ethereum and someday it becomes unprofitable, you can switch with the existing hardware to Zcash or Dash mining. But if your electricity costs are too high or your wife permanently says shut down that noisy box, home mining is not an option for you. Instead, you can mine in cloud. Cloud mining companies host mining hardware and sell you some amount of hash power. And that is nice. Just google cloud mining and you will find tons of mining companies that promise you 3 to 4 months of return on your investments. And even some of them give you some hash power for free. But 99% of them are scam. They don't own any hardware and use Ponzi scheme to suck your money out. And you will never reach your ROI if you invest there. Use betbitcoin.org to find out whether your cloud mining company is a scam. 
let's look at the bed list. As you see, it is quite long. Actually, there are very few cloud mining companies that have proved existence of mining farm. They are Genesis Mining and Hessian24. Personally, I use Genesis Mining. Let's examine Genesis Mining contracts. You can buy Bitcoin, Dash, Ethereum, Litecoin, Monero and Zcash mining contracts at Genesis Mining. But unfortunately Zcash, Lite and Dash contracts are out of the stock right now. Basically all contracts except Bitcoin mining contracts are similar. You pay some amount up front to get a hash power and you get two year mining contract without any fees like maintenance fee. So everything you have mined you get as a payout. In Bitcoin case contract is a little bit different. You also pay some money up front but the contract is perpetual so it has no expiration date but it has maintenance fee. If you look in this section maintenance fee is 0.00028 dollars per giga hash per day. So Genesis Mining will deduct this amount every day uh, as a maintenance fee. And once this amount becomes higher than your profit, contract will be terminated. So before buying any of these contracts, I recommend you to use mining calculator to find the most pro profitable deal. Let's estimate a profitability of a three mining contract. As example, let's take medium contract. It costs eight hundred and sixty nine dollars and you get 30 mega hashes. As a calculator I use CryptoConfair profitability calculator. It's quite simple. We need to insert our hash power and because we don't pay anything for electricity we'll leave this field as a zero. So if you purchase 30 mega hashes of Ethereum mining contract at Genesis Mining you will get as a profit 800 $85 per month. Our mining contract costs $869 and our monthly profit is $185. So you will reach your return on investment in approximately 4 or 5 months. And that's good case. Let's check some other option. So let's take one error. And as example, let's take Dynamo contract which costs $819 and you will receive one kilo hash if you purchase this contract. Monero, one kilo hash and leave electricity field blank. So if you purchase one kilo hash at Genesis Mine, you will receive 100 six dollar profit per month. As you remember your contract costs $818. So in case of buying one kilo hash you will reach your ROI approximately in seven eight months. So Ethereum is more profitable to mine in Genesis mining than Monero. And among available contracts, Ethereum is the most profitable coin to mine as of now. Probably when uh, Genesis Mining will return Dash and Zcash back to stock, there would be some other options, because Dash is generally more profitable than Ethereum. But as of now, Ethereum is the most profitable coin to mine. I started with Genesis Mining about a year ago with Bitcoin mining contract. As you see, I have invested $114 per 0.6 tera hashes. I have purchased very small amount just to figure out how it works. And currently I have reached my ROI, as you see from this chart, it happened even before May, and have some profits. Of course, because of block difficulty growth, my daily profit significantly dec decreased, but it's still making some money. Also, I have made two biggest mistakes people make when they buy Genesis mining contracts. First, 
I didn't upgrade my hash power constantly and I have still 0.6 tera hashes and therefore my daily profit is declining fast. And the second, I didn't use referral program till recent time. Referral program gives 3% discount to anyone who use my promo code here on any purchase at Genesis Mining. And I will receive 4% bonus from each dollars you spend on as a hash power or Bitcoin payouts. And this win-win case. Genesis Mining get their money, you buy cheaper and I receive extra hash power. So when you decide to buy new or great existing contract at Genesis Mining, please use my promo code. It is down below this video. Also drop me your promo codes in comments. I and other people who watch this video may use them too. Thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe to my channel if you want more videos and leave your questions in the comment section below. Bye.